look at his butt. It's like a little, little butt. Look how cute it is. He's like, I don't know if there's a hole, but there was or there isn't. But look, he's a butt. And he's adorable. It's like a little chef. I got this from my friend for my birthday. Hello everybody and welcome to today's talk about toxic productivity and basically relating our own personal like worth to how much you produce and how much work you're able to get done from a day-to-day -day basis. Um, this is not scripted. I did not bother the scripted because I'm putting this in the middle of a fucking vlog. So like, I've been trying to, you know, rest basically. But like over the winter break, I was trying to rest and like have like a very restful winter break, do everything that I wanted to do. I did get some things accomplished, granted, but I also like wasn't able to rest because I worked a lot during winter break, like more than I usually do, which is very strange. And I basically spent a lot of time just because of work, I was so exhaust exhausted. I couldn't do anything that I wanted to actually accomplish. I would be very upset and just like beat myself up for not being able to accomplish work because I was tired from having shifts at a job that I hated. I just, I feel like I wasted so much time just like being angry and like sad because I didn't do enough. Ooh, I had not written a 30,000 word novel yet by the time I'm 16. I'm going to die, I'm going to die lonely and I'm impoverished. currently January 8th and it's 7.18 which means I've been coding my stupid concept project for the past four hours which is terrific since it still does not work not to mention that I've been working on it for the past entire week I'm just seething with rage right now I'm so bathe in it for a couple of minutes more before I to return back to coding because I really need to get this on today because I need to do other stuff tomorrow and on Sunday because I have multiple assessments next week because I just ended the semester. <laughs> hey, I'm giving myself three more minutes to just like, sit here and just be mad about everything. Okay, time is up. I have to go back to do, doing my work. Um, this is the uh, program that I'm doing. It is uh, 200 lines long, and uh, um, I don't even know what it says because I didn't even fucking code this. I'm pretty sure because I think I I've, I've had like a fucking blackout seven times during while I was coding this, so half of it doesn't actually make sense to me. Listening to my favorite comfort music currently because. Uh, I'm going through some traumatic shit right now. <laughs> and uh, currently it is 9.30. So uh, two hours have gone by and I'm still working on the same fucking project. I'm gonna listen to some Mitski because I feel like crying in my bed, but I have to do my cups at work, so I'm going to emulate the aesthetic of crying in my bed with her songs. <gasps> I'm finally done. Oh my god, that took me, that only took me, oh my god, that only took me seven hours, that's great, oh wow. Oh my god, now I get to shower. I'm so excited. So I just showered and um, I think I look very cute in my adorable little sweater. I think I look fantastic if I do say so myself. This kind of looks like a cauliflower. It's very cozy though, I really like the sweater. Yeah, so I think I'm gonna just hang out with my friends probably, maybe watch some shows and then I'm gonna go to bed. So yeah.
Bye. See you tomorrow, which is literally in like a second for you. So, bye. It was a shit day for like no fucking reason because I was ha I was like having fun with my friends but that to me felt like I was wasting time and I felt like shit the entire night I literally cried myself to sleep because I felt like I was being useless and a wasteful member of society every time I want to do something I think to myself am I being productive am I being the most productive I can be in this time span am i able to do the most work that i can in this time span am i really utilizing my time well all that goes through my head whenever i want to do something if i want to watch a movie if i want to like um watch a tv show just like have fun i'll be like okay then you can draw while you're doing this because you need to produce something that you can post on your instagram and i've been recently so exhausted i do not i fucking i think i get so exhausted whenever i i even think about it. i have to, i have to draw i just i can't even get my tablet because i'm like oh wow, wow this is actually fucking exhausting and then if i want to listen to music just like sit around listen to music i'm like oh oh i have to read a book i have to read this novel for my english class while i'm doing it and it's just like trying to maximize everything i do to the fullest potential and it's just exhausting because when I'm, even when i'm calling my friends i'm like oh i can do this during like the time i can like draw while i'm calling my friends i can do my homework while i'm calling my friends i can input all these numbers into my balance sheet while i'm calling my friends I like my makeup today. I look very like airy and like fairy like. I look very cute. Can we just talk about the fact that I am supposed to know what the fuck I want to do with like my entire fucking life right now? I'm only 16. I got literally turned 16 less than a month ago. And I'm supposed to know what the fuck I want to do with my life because I need to decide what courses I'm going to take in order to get into the university I want at the end of this year, which I'm only going to be turning 17 by December. So that's a little bit fucked up, don't you think? I, I don't, I don't know what I want to do. Like, how am I supposed to know? You guys are, you're like, like they're shitting me, right? Like, I, I'm supposed to know this. It's like nobody else stressed because of this, like. Everybody's just like, oh yeah, I know what I want to do. I know these are the exact courses I want to take. And I'm going to be this when I grow up. And I'm going to have this job when I'm 30. And I have my entire career plan planned out. And I'm like, wow. Um, I barely know what I'm going to do tomorrow. Like, I don't, I have no clue what I want to do. And it's like, frightening. I was in a really shitty mood the entire day because I was doing nothing, but at the same time, because I was in a shitty mood, I didn't feel like doing anything. So you see how this cycle is just repeating, and I always feel shitty because I have not done anything, and that means I am a useless member of society. It feels like it's a ticking clock, you know, you only have so much time to get so much things done, and it makes me feel really anxious and really trapped and I don't like it. I wish that I didn't have to do all these things to be in order to be like, you know, I don't know, like productive or seen as contributing or seen as hardworking, you know? Just don't wanna wish I wasn't in a position like that. I just wanna Whatever. have more fun.
That's basically what this boils down to. I suppose. I don't know. I'm struggling with myself these days. Very, very much. I don't know what I want to do, and I hate any semblance of actual work because I hate all my courses that I'm taking, and I dislike everything. And I feel like I'm just heading towards a path where I hate everything I'm doing because I'm working hard on things that I hate. I don't even know what this video is going to be about. Am I going to post this video even? I have no clue. Maybe this will just be me rambling about how much I fucking hate life. Essentially. Basically. Yeah. I just feel like I have a time limit to get everything done. I need to quickly get everything done so that I can somehow become a better person. I don't know. So this is um, something that I've been working on since the beginning of January. I've only drawn it like once, but like, like basically on my art account, this is thing where I redraw this one character every new year. And usually I get it done on like New Year's Day or like day after New Year's Day, but um, right now it's like New Year's week, <laughs> basically. So I feel like I probably should get like a. I just want to be a little more at peace today, and that is my goal. To be a little more at peace, not be so chaotic. That's my goal for today to find peace peace to find peace and to be happy i suppose and to do some things that i like i don't even know what i like anymore because i've made everything that i like into a way to measure my productivity yeah i'm in such a bad mood right now i <sighs> i don't know Today was supposed to be a good day. I'm sorely disappointed. Very. At least I still have sparkly eyebrows. My eyebrows are still good. God damn. Okay. I'm gonna go shower and maybe I'll make me feel better with like, the hot water and stuff. I think I was supposed to like, feel like a hug or whatever. And like only people stay in like longer showers. Mm, yeah. Hopefully. Mm -hmm. I just. I just. I just want to be happy, essentially. I just want to be happy, okay? Today. Please. Like, I just want to be happy. Trying to be happy, I guess. Yeah, this is what this vlog is gonna be about. I'm gonna try to be happy, you know? Like, yeah. Trying to make myself happy without anybody else. That sounds very wrong. I did not mean it that way. I meant I just want to be happy, you know, the the, the chemical thing, not not the not the not, not the other thing. We get we're all Christians in this household, okay? We do not speak of such sinful actions i'm gonna yes i'm going to i don't know what i'm gonna do now i think i'm going to help someone do their essay because that makes you feel marginally better than so and, and i actually enjoy writing essays it's such fucking hell to edit because i rambled for basically 20 minutes all right great <laughs> <laughs>